I think this is gonna be the final boss room, yeah. Yep. The truth Boy, that was funny. Sanguinius. Oh, hey, we can talk with Sanguinius Hell Spirit, this is too. The point of Why? No return. Somewhere beyond this point, you just got here, hope I didn't mess out too much. Well, we're about to play the no end of the game. You missed a lot. <laughs> but so, oh, her spirit's just sitting here. All right, I'll come back it. later. Keith, apparently you have to lead, so you should lead. Oh yeah. Also, yeah. the spirit isn't talking with us. Maybe it'll talk to Bird, but I don't no, know. No, I can't us. talk to her. No. Here, Shell, I'm uh, sending you a hat. You might as well identify it. The rest of this stuff is garbage. <laughs> Quiet yonder. It is called the glare. It is. What the, the fuck? The fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh. Oh, Scandal that was horrible. Pyro. Uh, <laughs> it's talking to me. Master Fane, I never thought I'd see you again. It's been a long time since our time together in your library. I don't know what it sounds <laughs> like because it wasn't voiced. <laughs> it's me, Harina. Do do you remember me? Uh, gonna pretend. Harina, how could you forget? She's your best <laughs> assistant in the library. Oh, Master Fane, you were always kind. But more than that, you were always good. Always working so hard for a better world. A more perfect world. Let's see. Counter that you were proud and arrogant. She's a void woken because of your more perfect world. But what if I were void woken no longer? It's not too late, Master Fane. We can fix everything that went wrong. Everything. We could be free of tyrants, free of the seven, of the king of the void, free to live our lives and study the universe again. With your help, we could be restored, not as some twisted monsters, as our true selves. We could be eternals again. Whoa. Go with number two. Ask what could hold back the king and the void. The powers of the seven are the key. Once you have claimed them as your own, use them to open a gateway to the void so that we may return. We'll take back the source that was stolen from us to restore ourselves as Eternals. Then we'll use the source of the seven to close the hole they created. And we'll make sure the void and the king stay on the other side. Together we can do it. You can right this wrong and restore the Eternals. Please, Master Fane, set us free. And she ah. skitters. Look at her go. It was weird and super creepy. Yeah, well, it used to be a person. Well, yep. Ready to go? Used to be a librarian. The truth yep. hangs heavy upon the air so, itself. The truth hangs heavy upon the air this itself. This is the point of no return. This is the point of no Somewhere return. Beyond Somewhere this point, beyond this point, you shall be undone. You shall be or undone. You shall or you shall ascend. ascend. There There's no, no middle, ground. middle ground. I'm talking the same time as this guy, and it's a pain. Anyway, you're ready for this. Step into your destiny. Ready. Ready, check. No biggie. I just have to defeat all of you, or the Eternals will forever be doomed to be void weapon. Uh, it's Yay. fine. We'll cross is that, that bridge how when it we is? come to it. No, we will burn that bridge when we see it. Why don't we just kill Me the god? Meanwhile, I, my competitors are the king of the dragons and two people that don't really have destinies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my character's already fulfilled his destiny. Like, at this point, the Red Prince could just leave, well, probably. Well, that's oh, start. Uh, Hi, Melody wow. and Tarquin. Oh, uh, huh. They decked us. Thanks. You come here often. I don't know what you did, but you just released a source blood. I thought I'd come and see what all the fuss was about. Should have known you were getting yourself into trouble. Looks like the big moment has finally arrived. I will do everything I can to support you, Godwoken. I will pray for you. I think you'll need it. Respond with gratitude. The prayer will inspire and strengthen you. Don't underestimate the power of true prayer. This is a place of incredible power where a single prayer holds the weight of thousands. Your heart and soul will fill as quickly as they're drained. Consider it a taste of your divine future. Prayer will enrich you, and your disciples will empower you, strengthen you, and trust you in all ways to do only what is right. Of course, it's up to you whether or not to listen. I know how I'd respond, but you do you. Malady wearily chuckles to herself. Then bows her head in a show of unexpected but sincere reverence. Looks like my investments paid off after all. You've shown me kindness in the face of my sins. My worship 
is the least I can offer. Now go. Rivalon needs a new divine. Dark Lord, I got a question. Something tells me Who he was supposed to be you? Gareth and like if other people. If only he knew about Gareth. like the 17 times you asked to murder him. <laughs> you yeah. showed me kindness. It's like, can I kill him? He said something kind of rude seven hours ago. <laughs> What's the orb? Yeah, do we just go to it? There's a. Oh, the seven are all there. Yeah. Uh... Oh, no, they're not. Those are. That's. <gasps> Cloaked figure Dallas. Dallas, Dallas and Dallas. Wait, Geist is back? And Fucking the Geist. Geist is back again? Oh, wait, they're well, all Geist, Geist, aren't there. Geist, sir, they're like combat slaves. Oh, yeah, and the cloaked figure is probably Varig Brend or whatever his name was. SP cost. Yep. Oh, Wander, you got your you got your wish. We have no yeah. source point cost. Yeah, source points are free. Oh, as long oh as they're free here. in this section. Yeah, you oh. should probably load up on all of your source spells. Oh, My wait, God. Les still uses a source point. Huh. That's wait. No, Thunderstorm uses uh three source points for me. No, I think that when you use it, it doesn't cost that oh, much. Oh, I see. It's a it's status effect. Gotcha. Let's find out. That's probably a bad idea to just do. Yeah, that was free. And there was no targets. Cool, nothing yeah. happened. That was pyroclastic eruption. Alrighty. Shall we... Uh... Was, at the moment I clicked it, I'm like, maybe I shouldn't have just done this. I don't know if Wonder saved. <laughs> but I, shall we uh, rush forth and accept our... De our, uh, our In two turns, when I get pyroclastic eruption back. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fair point. Okay. I've loaded up on... But it still has those giant of... cooldowns. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, all right, I... now it's back. We probably That's don't need Bless, do sneaking we? Sneaking failed because nope. your allies are here. They're dicks. <laughs> I don't like how sneaking doesn't work cause, just because allied people see you, so you can't sneak past enemies. That makes no sense. It's just when I see you, I assume I'm just shouting, I see Fane! I see Fane! I see <laughs> <You> Fane! <laughs> you can't sneak in Skyrim, a horse sees you, and the horse has reported you for thievery. Oh shit, Lucian's down there. Look at yeah. him. Yeah, Lucian the Divine. He's looking badass. Alright, he's, he's, way, he's wearing more clothes than I'm used to from all the paintings we keep seeing. <laughs> oh, we can just go in through the front. Alright, yep. I'm gonna I'm gonna quick save, and let's go. Yeah, Lucian looks fine. Mostly fine. Right. <laughs> I'm sneaking, mostly fine. So I'm ready. He looks I'm ready for this fight to go. All right. God woken. Dallas told me about you. You must be as hard as diamonds and twice as bright to have come so far. Your divine welcomes you. Surprise. Lucian frowns at the figure, then bestows a benevolent smile upon you. All that you know of him flashes across the panorama of your mind. You open your mouth to speak. I underestimated you, Godwoken. You have proven to be- I'm bringing us back. Apparently, Fane has to do this. Really? Oh. Yep. That would make probably, sense. Probably for yeah. the Void subplot but... line. Yep. Also, don't I know this dude? <laughs> Yep. Uh, God yeah. Woken. I know this asshole. Dallas told me about you. Your divine surprise. Lucian frowned. I underestimated you, God Woken. You have proven to be a formidable foe. You have my respect. Respect, indeed. Lucian's gaze rests upon you and goes through you. He takes your measure entirely. Lucian. We should tell the Godwoken the truth. Yes, I agree. It is time we dropped our masks. What? Mm -hmm. But it looks like Mark Hamill. Then reaches for the sides of her head. Where there was one face, suddenly there are four. She takes off the mask of the shapeshifter. She's also an eternal in disguise. Mm -hmm. Dun, dun, dun. A skull is revealed, bejeweled and ancient as the void. I am eternal. Surprise, surprise. Do you say other words? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Cloaked figure is like, he's Brackus Rex. He's got to be. <laughs> he, I mean, he says surprise, surprise so much. He's got to be the final surprise. Demanding explanation. <laughs> Pretend that you knew it. Fear not. <laughs> Dallas is on the side of all that is good. She is helping me rid Rivalon of the influence of the source. Listen to her. 
I shall tell you the tale as I told it to Son Lucian. Of a bitch. Long ago, the scholar Fane discovered that the veil between the world and the void was made of source. Our seven lords desired this power. Of course. Silence, slave. Our king forbade the seven to reach for this power, but they didn't listen. Instead, they rebelled and sent the king and his people into the void. With the source they stole from the veil, the seven created the races so they would have worshippers. Ask why the Seven Lords would have needed worshippers. During their lives, worshippers collect source. When they die, the gods feed from them. It's an ingenious system. Our souls are nothing but vats for the source-hungry gods. The Seven made a mistake. By taking its source, they tore a hole in the veil, and it is through this hole that the Void finds its way into our world. The Seven's lust for power let in the Void. Our goal is to close the hole they created, to restore the source to the veil. When we are done, there shall be no more source in the world. No more gods, no more worship, no more war, no more chaos, no more demons, no more Void Woken. Rivalon will have peace at last. Yeah, no more war. That's always worked before. <laughs> ask why, ask Dallas, quote, 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 why she would betray her fellow Eternals. My people cannot be allowed to return from the Void. They are tarnished. They are Void Woken. They can only bring chaos and death and... There is more, but she hesitates to share it. Then she decides... I was but a child when the war started. The king in his fury separated my family and scattered us across the world to be entombed he did this because it was my father who gave the seven the secret of the veil against the king's explicit instructions uh, uh, the isn't the king's punishment is what saved me from the void only a very few eternals escaped banishment myself my mother and what was that wonder uh you yeah maybe she's, you're her i think father. she's fane's daughter <laughs> Yep. Fane. Yes. Fane. You are my father. That's not true. <laughs> That's, That's impossible. impossible. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Fane, you are my dad. Wait, so whose hand gets cut <laughs> off in this situation? Because I'm confused. Uh, uh, her com her companion's face. <laughs> oh, fair enough. Oh, dude, I get to get Brackus Rex's face. <laughs> I don't. Dallas that... gives you a steady look, cool and collected. This is your daughter. You are her father. If you had guts, they'd be churning. Every act of horror Dallas committed, that was your daughter? Everything I did, I did to fix your mistake. Our people, every purged sorcerer, every dead magister, all those weeping families, they're on your head, father. I learned it from watching you, dad. I, mm -hmm. I want to say this right now. I think throughout this entire game, Fane truly was like the main character. And yeah. I'm kind of disappointed they didn't just make him the canonical main character. Yeah, I agree. Instead, For a we while, just, I didn't instead even have... we glitched out half his interactions, and I had to go <laughs> back and find them. <laughs> and now, in my mother's name and my own, I take my revenge on the king and the seven, and to you, father, I offer the opportunity to atone for your sins. Did you even look for me, father? Wow, well, that was a tone shift. Control your emotions. Yep. Our purpose transcends your personal wounds. You. You are right. So as best as I can tell, the reason why the voices keep changing volume is actually something that Wander and I and so on would have learned from editing, which is that mm -hmm. they have a bunch of normalized clips that are spit at, split at different points, and based on the highest volume point of that particular clip, 
uh, yep. like the dynamic it, range, the high mm -hmm. point is normalized, so the rest of it's quiet. Whereas yeah. if you just do a flat whisper sentence, then it's all going to sound loud because it's, it's all none of it has a peak. She was yelling before, oh. so yeah. It. Okay, yeah. so detail details for Fane. So Fane was not intended to be uh, a character in this game to begin with, they and it was also undead. written by a completely different person. Huh. Mm -hmm. uh, Fane was the last character they added. They are they yeah. were so far along in development that the wait like they had the they had all of the origin characters on that one wallpaper, and my character's not on it. <laughs> yep. Yes, oh, but. Yeah. It's True. weird that they added who is ostensibly the main character last. Mm -hmm. They they just, He's just made the character they, with they the just, shady past. Yeah. Someone, it, well, it's like one of those Doctor Who episodes that establishes wildly important stuff that comes out of nowhere. Yep. It's like somebody just wrote new stuff onto the existing canon that latches onto it, and, and it seems really big, despite it not originally being part of the story. So you're, you're saying you're a it. Mary, you're you're Gary, you're Dad Stew? No, it's not a Mary Sue. It's <laughs> I, know, I know, I know. I'm just joking. <laughs> it's like the Dragon Age expansions that massively re recontextualize the universe, but they're added like as the 17th pack of content for this to the ongoing franchise. And you're like, oh, this is how the whole world works. I'm learning this late. Dallas has her reasons, as you can see. I seek peace for Rivalon and for myself. Her ambitions align with my own, and I always believed the goal justifies the means. Ask how an Eternal becomes a general in the Divine Order. During the war, the real Dallas found my tomb. I took her place and quickly realized that Lucian was the key to my vengeance. And I was the key to the salvation of Rivalon. Wonder how they intend to achieve their ambitions. While Dallas sought the Eteran, I started draining the gods of their source. Slurp, slurp, slurp. <laughs> I drink your milkshake. One more word from you and I shall use the leash. I had to hide from the gods. So I had the walls of this crypt equipped with tenebrium and protections put in place. It worked. Everyone, even the gods, thought me dead. As divine... I was created, empowered to stop the void. I was the avatar of the Seven, their strength and their weakness. My bond to them allowed me to drain them of their source. Suggest that stealing the source of the Seven weakened the gods and allowed the Void Woken to appear. Indirectly. When the Death Fog was unleashed, many elves died. With fewer elves to worship him, Tyrus and Dilius weakened. This gave the God King his first real foothold back in the world. To strengthen himself, he sent his Void Woken, the remnants of my people, to hunt down the sorcerers seeking to reclaim their source. We turned the appearance of Void Woken to our advantage. To fix the veil, all source needs to be removed from the world. Blaming the sorcerers for Voidwoken made them easier to capture. The Eteran now contains almost all of the source the Seven stole. Soon, we will be able to heal the Veil. The Void shall be banished, and I, Lucian the Divine, shall return from the dead. A false Divine, of course. I shall have no power. But the world will not know this. I shall demand peace, and we shall have it. The plan is almost complete. We have made so many sacrifices, Godwoken. All of us, of ourselves and those we love. One last sacrifice is required for the future of Rivalon. You must surrender your source. Fane. This is your one chance to set right your wrongs. It is time for you to atone for your sins. There is no other way. The source of the world is required to close the veil. All of the source. We only lack yours. And yours, and yours, and yours. <laughs> <laughs> Note that giving up one source renders one a silent monk, a husk of oneself, a non-being. As I say, one last sacrifice is required. Yours. 
Remark that their plan means there shall be no true divine. Good. You understand. The world shall not know this. I shall return from the grave. A divine without power, yet all who desire power shall fear me. I shall carry the secret of my lack of divinity. Peace shall reign. Note that Lucian's massacre of the masters and students of the academy wasn't really done to aid Alexander. We already had more than enough Godwoken. Another sacrifice I was forced to make. Those beautiful people. I was as kind as I could be. I promise you that. Tell them you've heard enough. Then let us proceed. Show some responsibility, father. Surrender your source. What a thing. You'll be a hero. Everyone will know of the sacrifice you'll make. Your name will be synonymous with the survival of Rivalon. I like it how we could actually just be like, sure. <laughs> yeah, but it's your, it's everyone's sacrifice. It's not yeah. just Fane. It's just all of the conversations act like there's one person in the group. Well, nope. Don't yes. let them do this to us. But our souls, there has to be another way. Hey. No, never. <laughs> <laughs> if you want my soul, you'll have to take it by force. Try, and it'll cost you your life. I understand. Sacrifice takes courage. Wow, I backhanded. Though it pains me. Your sacrifice shall be made for you. Dallas. I'm sorry. You've come such a long way. But there is too much at stake. This is the end. It's no use. Take this. I hate it. Oh my when god, there's a lot more of them. I hate it when people like this talk about sacrifice, but it's other sacrifice and not their own. Yeah, yeah that's why we're killing them. She's really good at mass sacrificing people. <laughs> oh god. Wow, that, that was really fucking good weird sound sounding. Frame, right? Really weird. Yeah. Well, uh, right. Don't forget, drink your teas. Oh yeah, everything has like a seemingly epic echo to it. Well, it's done in like slow mo. Yeah, <laughs> everything has a thing where like every every impactful sound has like a deafened sound to it, and then like a, uh, uh, uh. Yeah. yeah, it's like a slow motion sequence. Jesus, jeez, sounds, that sounds so awful. Sounds awful. Yeah, <laughs> this is not working. Can we turn the theme music up compared to this? What's my? Oh, there it the is. The music's good because it's like the violin yeah. version of the intro song. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, you could always just turn off the sound effect. Actually, I'm gonna go turn off my sound effects. Go to way to make your ending sound epic is do a sad version of the title screen music that they've heard 75 times while playing through the game. Because <laughs> they hear it every time they launch it, so it's the one song burned into your brain. They did that with Undertale. Next one. That's a nice violin. <laughs> Jesus! Oh, Kill the us. party! <laughs> the entire you... party is dead. Huh. I was you... not aware. You wanted this! That would murder you guys. Okay, give me a second. Well, you better revive us. Yes. It's not a very effective way to no, win a fight. <laughs> I honestly was expecting that would uh, be Don't less be catastrophic on top of to you all guys. Of your allies? <laughs> Wanders Judas sing already. <laughs> he wants to be the divine. <laughs> right. No, no, no. I'm not Jesus Christ that was effective. <laughs> it it was? I apologize. Yeah. Talking about yeah. uh self sacrifice is Wander just self sacrificed <laughs> all of us. <laughs> so, yeah, Wander's good at sacrificing other people too, apparently. <laughs> God, God that's you just bad. let out a massive fire fart. You're thinking, I'm like, very effective at fire farts. Sounds. Did you just use like 17 spells? Yes. And he used. He drank tea. But I tea drank broken hella tea. Well, I'm prone, so goodbye only turn. <laughs> yeah, this fight's not gonna last oh, long enough. This guy. No, it's not. Turns out oh casting pyroclastic eruption, uh, meteor shower, earthquake, all in one turn is very, very effective. Right, because you have infinite source, so you can just use every dumb, ridiculous thing. Yeah, to prior to this fight, I loaded up on every single uh, source spell I, I possibly could. I forgot to use the T and shit. I should have. 
Well, you're, uh, you have the tea in your inventory. You can, uh, tea doesn't cost any AP to use. Oh, okay, nice. Yeah. Alrighty. I haven't Let's been given the opportunity tea. to use tea yet. Oh, uh, drink the fire resist oh, tea, I didn't... by the way. I thought I had oh, wait. tea. Where is it? I didn't give you the fire resist tea. I'm sorry. I didn't think anybody would need it. Actually, I'm I don't think I have any of the tea. keys. You should. I think I don't have tea either. What? Yeah, I yeah, yeah I might have gotten undone from one of our save scouts. Oh, because we reloaded. I, I'm sorry. I had spoken with Lady Chem, so I have plenty of tea. Well, I'm sorry, guys. Tea, but... Oh, it's fine. I guess. Hmm. I don't know. I'll have a turn someday. I don't know. This this looks fun. Uh oh. <laughs> I like how uh. it's missing. There we go. You healed that person. Yeah, apparently well, Dallas heals from lightning. Oh, whoa. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah, 110% air Dallas and 200% poison because they're undead. Something. Yeah, she's Dallas the Hammer. Yeah, she's Dallas the hammer. Lucian's almost dead already. Yeah, well, he was standing next to me for almost all of the uh, salvo. Yay, my turn. So I... Let's see. Can I drink tea? Yep. Now, uh, start taking out the Marks woman, the Marks people. Apparently, there's a uh, second phase of this fight. Okay. Okay. And getting them out. Well, since is a good I idea. can use my super special abilities. Wait, how are they too far? I'm noticing these Here characters don't. None of them seem to be immune to charm. <laughs> what the hell was that? I fired on them, but it didn't hit them. What's wrong? I don't know. I. Huh. That was so weird. Uh, you're not... Oh, you're blinded. Wait. I'm blinded. Uh, but I should have... Mm. Interesting. That's rough. Yeah, when well, you're blinded, I don't, think, I don't know if range attacks work. Well, she managed to uh, sky shot the Markswoman But she went elsewhere? backwards? Oh, yeah, Erratic Wisp. Teleport when hit by weapons or skills. Ah, interesting. Yeah. And plus 40% air resist. Miss. This isn't good. Eh, it's fine. We're gonna easily, handily win this fight. I'm gonna use this just like fa straight up like factory tubes of uh, of source pumping everywhere. Yeah, that's really weird because that's like. Oh, um, was I killed again? Like, Lucian teleported us here. Wow. Yep, I'm dead. You went from having a lot of status effects to having zero status effects, or besides the, the effect of being a dead man. Hmm. Um. I actually really don't like the um, toned down side effect, um, sound effects. Blah. No, it sounds horrible. Oh, it's yeah. Horrible. I, I, I I turned I turned it off. Uh, let me think. I don't have an easy way to teleport up there, do I? But I do have this. Oh, does that mean all my T buffs went away too? Yeah. Uh. Yep. Seems like you might be pretty teed off. Well, I have one more cup of tea. <laughs> oh, I do have this. Oh, I do have this. Hello. I, I'm picturing like Keith with like one of those ties, like bow ties that spins in a circle when you pull a cord. It's like that. Oh, he's invulnerable, son of a. Now I'm just thinking of that weird shark that was in, that in a shitty copycat of Scooby Doo. Jabberjaw. Uh, yeah. I love Jabberjaw. It's like Scooby Doo, but a shark, which is way more family friendly and cuddly. It's the, it's full, the, the tooth missile of meat. <laughs> <laughs> and then one of them was a Aww. car. It was like a sputtery, uh, cheeky thing. Hey, Keith. Car. Sending us. Or not Keith. Hey, bird. You, uh, you get to wait, go what? out of the level. What? But is that going to actually. I help? don't know. Maybe it'll keep you safe. It's. I mean, you'll be less AoE friendly, at least. Yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking. I don't know. Uh, fire. I'm really amused by the concept of cast flight on the ground, is how they always say it. God damn it. Yeah, that always is really weird. Just so this, one turn. this this boss fight really is just Wanderbot versus every... <laughs> what? <laughs> the source. That looks dangerous. Wait, uh, are you just going down the stairs? Source infused. Congrats, uh. you're source infused. You gained huh. a source point. Huh. 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 Yay! <laughs> <laughs> no, stop. Uh, God damn it. I'm, I'm gonna have all of the source. I'm just oh, sucking was, up oh, source. I, I resisted death. Ow. 
It's basically hey guys, just a giant the Tyrion is on the wall over there. Well, oh. I've died th three times now. I wonder if someone could like pluck it off right, or. Sabeel gets. Oh to yeah, go there it is. Here. I don't think you can attack it though. <laughs> what? Didn't go very well. This is my last red scroll. Oh, I can't get Fane. I'm sorry. Running have, out of them? I have eight red, red, scroll, no, you're red just, scrolls uh, and no, in a smoke I, cloud. I have run out of them because I'm the one that revives you guys. Because we die oh. sooner than you do. Yep. Actually be the tank. I if they would hit me, sure. <laughs> I suppose they always teleport to us and then kill they us. They don't seem to give a shit about hitting me. They seem Tanking to be very focused on murdering in this game because they attack the whoever's shit. vulnerable. So the yeah. more you tank yourself up, the less of a target you are. What plant? Yeah. Blah, blah, blah. Don't shoot Dallas. Solution's dead. It's just uh. Oh no, he's right there. Never mind. Okay, he's up here. No, that's. He's not vulnerable there. anymore, at least. Death. Well. No death. Stupid giant smoke cloud. Where's Dallas going? She's going to cast all, smoke cloud There's all on this me. story Chill. hype for Fane, and then Fane's been the entire fight incapacitated. <laughs> I'm going to come back here. This is bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to run into the vortex of stars. Abandon all my friends. If Did I let everyone that... else stay dead, the enemies would start targeting me. That, I mean, Wait, it's did not. Do you think that running into the pool is going to make you divine? I don't know, man. It worked once. <laughs> is that what you were going for? Like, I like, yes. how, I like how the theme theme for bird tonight is run into door, hope it breaks things. Hey, it's a pretty solid. Well, he, oh, that's he not even he, remotely what, what fair. Ha what happened is he thought he saw his chance to win the game out of the four of us. It's true. <laughs> okay, so. Hopefully I don't die before I actually can put some use to this. I got my tea. That's intelligence. This is ridiculous. Should Jeez. I even bother whole... trying to trying to restore my magic armor or not really? No, uh, just nah. start hitting them just or something. Oh, them. uh, can you send me half of your uh, revival scrolls, or just maybe all of them? I can send them to you in the middle of combat. Yep. Oh yeah. Um, let me look. Because my bags are all grayed out. Let's see. Just. Okay, um, split item. You want to give me like six? Because generally I'm Captain Medic. Thank you. Give you half of those. Okay, no, what can I do? Uh, oh, she's hidden behind that. Is Dallas? Dallas is hidden behind part of the statue. Well, can you see, uh,. Can you see the cloaked figure? Actually, jump to the area above you if you can. This? Yeah. Ooh, that would be actually really good. Uh, let me see if I can't... Oh, no, I can't. I growl. I can, oh. I can only leap to essentially the area on the floor where Dallas is, and that's it, which is... A Maybe that. Yeah. Because especially since she's melee, I don't know. Well, sky shot. I can keep oh, reviving her or something. <laughs> Yeah, let's see. I just want to mind control them, but I don't want to turn. I want to make Dallas fight Lucian. That's your own daughter, dude. Yeah. That's fucked up. She's also like a massacre. -er. She's really not in the line of sight. It's oh, it's because of a huge smoke cloud. Yep. Interesting. She laughs at you when you shoot her. That yeah, works. Yeah, I think that's just just really weird any other one slot skills i can do nope well you can use anything really? all you can use all of your abilities because you use t i did use t yeah so you can use anything whoa it adds on to it instead of yeah any uh, everything costs two less minimum one so go nuts uh-oh uh-oh lucian ba -doop. and dead he can just one. <sighs> yep. Kind of bullshit. Yep, that's why I want to mind control him. Was he... Yeah, revive Fane so that he can <sighs> mind control him. Can I? Then I can Actually, mind control I... a god. Actually, I should have used a charm arrow then. Oh. Uh, but I didn't know if he was in range at the time. Especially um... with all that 
smog. If it looks like it's dissipated already. Oh, yeah, it's all gone. That's good. Hello. Hello. I am deflecting emotionally and physically. And that's why I'm revered, but also cursed, I guess. Why am I cursed again? <laughs> My... Uh, oh, I disappeared. I'm back. I'm uh, maybe when you got uh, cursed, you got cursed by the God King again. Oh, weird. Because it was gone for a while, for some reason. Yeah, I think it might have come back. Hmm. Wait, the God King is Brachus Rex, right? No. It's not, no. It's not Lucian, is it? No. The God King is just some dude in the void. Okay. Who is eternal. Are you feeling poorly, Dallas? Oh, of course. Good. You shall not seal the veil. And now it is time. A double cross? Who could have seen the cloaked figure being like, surprise, surprise, he would have a surprise. I call on the God King. <laughs> Come claim what is yours. You guys, now? I think we found phase two. What? You are unleashed. Surprise. Surprise. Uh, surprise. Oh my god, you're annoying. <laughs> you left the leashing wand next to me, you stupid maggot. So accustomed had you become to me pretending to be your slave. Yeah, this is anime. Uh... Kill him. Do <laughs> shut up, you tedious buffoon. And don't look so surprised. As if I would allow a bone bag to enslave me. Me! Sit back and enjoy the comfort, discomfort. You should have listened to Tarquin, you worm-ridden wench. <laughs> Nobody enslaves <laughs> Bracchus is. Rex. It's Bracchus Rex. Oh I was right. It I was right. Bracchus I'm... Rex. I am the Source King. <laughs> oh, he's both. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hello! Bracchus Rex, you ignorant dog. Bracchus. Kill him. Now. Too late, you moldering, blight-stained pigs. Grant <laughs> me power, my ally. God King, I call on you. Uh, laugh at Brachus's nativ naivety. Naivety. Not nativity. <laughs> <laughs> the God King naivety. will never share rule. The Source King is doomed. Oh. Oh, uh, I could have done that. interrupt Brachus Rex. You would interrupt the Source King. You shall redefine suffering. This speech becomes amazing if you replace the word source with the word sauce. <laughs> <laughs> Suddenly, Brackish Chef, the Sauce King. <laughs> you dare interrupt the Sauce King.